Hey everybody, it's The Walker. So what are we doing today? Well, today we have a solar eclipse, and what we're gonna try to do is a solar eclipse fire via magnification using a PSK Frenzel lens. So we are about 70, looks like about 70%, and I think this is about as good as time to see if we can get a fire going. Let me show you what I have. Here we got, we got some wood over here. We have a kind of a hastily thrown together tinder bundle. So we'll see if that gets working. We've got some, um, we're gonna need some charred materials. I think that may be our best shot at this. Since this is like kind of like one of those once in a lifetime things, we're not gonna go cheesy. We're gonna use a good amount. And let's see what we have inside the PSK. This is my Topps Turley Rebuild. Man, there's not a lot of sun out here, and there's a little bit of clouds in the sky, too. That doesn't bode well, but we'll see if we can get going. Plus, it looks kind of weird out. There we are. Boy, it's this um, Ranger band is kind of falling apart on me. All right, we need to find, we need to scrounge up that lens. So we'll see what we have here. Boy, there's a lot of good stuff in this PSK. What we want is the lens. And there's the lens. Whoops. The lens is right here. Nice PSK, though. Okay, we're about at, um, looks like prime, when I'm getting 72% uh, solar eclipse. So see what we get. Man, it looks weird, and there's passing clouds, too. Oh, it looks so weird out. All right. It's hard to get enough energy to concentrate a beam with this little Frenza lens. Hold their weight. Come on. This is weird looking sunlight too. Wait, wait, wait. All right. We're in. Oops. Nope. Looking good, it's looking good. There we go. Take a look. Man, there's not a lot of light. Whoa, move this camera a little bit away from this. Wow. There we are. We did it. I didn't think we were going to pull that one off. Well, I did not think even for a second we are going to pull that one off. But we did. A little more birch bark.
I did not think, man, I did not think that was gonna work. I did, absolutely did not think that was gonna work. There we go, that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. I did not think, did not for sure. There we are. I suppose that's the um, big advantage is, look, I mean, look at those condi solar conditions. I mean, it's breaking, breaking out there. Cloudy. We have, um, I don't know if this lens, this lens will actually work on the camera or not. Let's give it a try. I don't think so, though. I don't think you can see. Probably not. But um, per my eye, there's a sliver of sun left. Just a sliver. You'll never see that, but that doesn't matter. The main thing is, it worked. All right. Okay, that wasn't so bad. That really wasn't so bad. Um, using a PSK, Forenza lens, during 70% um, solar eclipse. Man, that looks cool. That looks really cool. We're able to get a fire using this little lens. I suppose that's one advantage to um, charred materials is that uh, they're black, they ignite easily. So even in uh, challenging solar conditions such as, well, an eclipse, and cloudy sky, we pulled it off. All right, well, that's about it. Um, if you like what you've seen, give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and y'all have a great day, and enjoy your solar eclipse.